Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernardo from the BTN HD, and yes, uh, this is actually a product review for you guys. And at my job, I'm normally asked to convert a PDF to a Word or a Word to a PDF. And don't get me wrong, Acrobat Professional is great, but because of the price, it's always a problem. Pricing and budgeting is always a problem with the program. Uh, I found this cool program called Able to Extract. Uh, it's pretty good. It's actually it's not pretty good. It's pretty awesome. And the reason why it, it does what Acrobat Professional uh, allows you, you know, basically convert your Word to PDF and PDF to Word or Excel or Publisher or PowerPoint or, or HTML, AutoCAD if you're into uh, construction, even Open Office. Now the pricing. You're probably saying what's the difference in the pricing well I'm gonna show you guys the purchase for a full license is a hundred bucks you could do a 30-day subscription which is $34.95 which is okay that price is a lot better and they support Windows Apple and Linux for Acrobat professional it's $19.99 per month that's 20 bucks times 12 for a year that's how much you guys are gonna be spending for that I'd rather pay a hundred dollars flat get the upgrades for free and have more abilities to convert things into different formats with no problem now when you install this application you gotta make sure that you have office 2013 or 2010 installed because once uh, something gets converted it opens up automatically on the format that you choose uh, don't get me wrong if you don't have office installed into your machine it will still work so I'm gonna show you guys uh, so let's open up a document. I have a PDF on my desktop right here. I'm actually going to close it and I'm going to show you that this PDF is really intense with a lot of stuff in it. So this is the PDF and this is a PowerPoint presentation that I did with you guys is how to speed up the Pixie Boot time. And I'm going to open that up within Able to Extract 9 and right away it opens up really fast as soon as you open up a PDF it gives you a nice little tool tip uh, giving you steps of what to do uh, you're able to select what you want to convert so let's say I want to just select something and again they give you nice little tool tips it gives you an option how you want to do it. you want to do Excel Word PowerPoint publisher image AutoCAD HTML open office awesome so I'm just gonna close the tool tip now and what I want to do is I want to select everything. I want everything within this PowerPoint to be selected. So I'm going to go down as you can see everything is selected. I'm going to pick Word. Uh, the only reason why I'm picking Word because this is the most common thing that's asked of me at my job. Hey Bernardo, I want you to convert this PDF because I don't have the original and I, mean, I need to make some modifications. So let's convert this PowerPoint into a Word document. So I'm going to save it into my desktop and I'm going to change the name as word presentation word convert Let's do that and we're going to hit save so right now able to extract nine is doing it doing this thing behind the scenes is converting it it depends on the size of the PDF as well as how intense the PDF is with word images and, and graphics as you can see it open up automatically with word 2013 if you don't have Office installed or open office installed in your machine, it's going to give you a warning, but it will still convert that document into a PDF, which is pretty awesome. And then you just pick it. Now, from here, I'm able to uh, edit the image, move the image around as I want. I'm able to edit the text. As you can see, let's say it was, uh, I needed capital, capitals on that, I'm able to delete. So it's awesome. And then from here, I've saved it as a Word document. Now, with any program that allows you to convert a PDF to Word, uh, the formatting gets kind of iffy. Me using Able to Extract, the format was kind of precise about 85% of the time, which is great. The only time it got a little messed up, like right here, uh, just extra spacing and stuff is a little weird. So as you can see, you got to go inside the document and just modify the spacing. But, you know, with any converter, it's, it's like that. Uh, I have tried Acrobat Professional and sometimes like the formatting is just everywhere. With Able to Extract, it, they're kind of precise. I give it about 85% precise of keeping the formatting the way that you want it. 
Now, the cool thing about this is that I work for an architect uh, company, and AutoCAD will be wonders for them. Uh, creating DWG and as well as DXF files to export them into a Revit program so they're able to remodel uh, what they build within AutoCAD is great. So I love this program on that part. Uh, the pricing is there. I love the way it works. You even have a searching feature. You're able to search within the thing. They give you a nice little thumbnail view of everything. Uh, if you're not a Office uh, fan, you and you have Open Office. Now, Open Office you can actually install it on the PC, but is well known for the Linux side. I've used it on the Linux side. It's a, it's a free version uh, that allows you to create Word, Excel, PowerPoints, uh, free, just like Word. Uh, you can able you're able to let's uh, go to Open Office. Pick you know pick which one you wanted to convert. It's really simple. I really enjoy using able to extract for my day to day uh, stuff at my job. You're able to do even batch within it. Add all your files. Choose the way you want to convert it. Windows standard frame text PowerPoint. Uh, this location and that's it you're good to go it's really that simple just like Acrobat Professional when you install Acrobat Professional they give you an Adobe PDF printer and believe it or not uh, with able to extract they also give you a uh, printer as well so I'm gonna go into the devices and connect the devices and as you can see I got an able to extract 9.0 printer now so far I've been using it with Windows 10 which is the latest build 9926 it's been working wonders I haven't had any problems with it it converts stuff really smooth with no problem uh, and that's it guys that is my review on the able to extract 9.0 I really don't have any negativity on it because it's been doing what I wanted to do and that's convert stuff right away fast and simple and uh, allowing me to have less time getting into the document and editing and, and converting or manipulating the formatting the way I want it. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this uh, review. Give me thumbs up if you guys enjoy the video because it does support the video as well if you give me those thumbs up. And I catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.